right in the studio. This is the latest on my discast. I'm going to tell you about... So as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest stuff. What's up, I'm JR. You're chilling all right. Let's get started. Live from Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest on my update that I'm willing to tell you about. So as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest. Hello, my name is Jerome J. Harden, founder and graphic designer of Jerome Harden Studios. Um, I'm in, in downtown Huntsville once again. Um, I was here two weeks ago. I made a video about it. And you can see that the, the fadeness of my head, the line finally disappeared. Thank God. Because I wear too many bandanas these days. And it's very hot right now. Um, it's about, about 71, 76 degrees. Um, about in the 70s in the middle. But who cares? It's almost summertime and I'm wearing sandals. Well, felines that is. I'm not wearing shoes, but I'm wearing sandals. But I'm not going to party tonight because I'm very tired. Had a long week. I was working, making money, make myself a living, doing business, doing graphic design, all that stuff. So, um, right now, I'm about to go get something to eat. Before I do that, I need to show you guys something. What the heck is that? Oh, wrong door. Sorry. Anyways... Looks like it's very busy tonight. Um, there's a lot of tents set up. Uh, the roads are closed. I don't know what's going on. Um, I think, I think right there is uh, where they doing company photos. But I think it's the Heart Walk. Um, they're doing an event on. So yeah, um, there's a lot of signs and still. And last time I was here, um, like I said. A lot of people here tonight, so a lot going on in this area on this weekend, but tomorrow it's supposed to storm. Oh, what's that over there? I did not see that. What's this over there? See, what's that over there? Um, I think, yeah, it's a stage. Wow. See, what I tell you. I think it's a lot of events going on. A lot of traffic coming in and out of the downtown area, so, um... Yeah. Well, buses can't go, cars can't go through, track is blocked. So, safe to say, I can cross here without any kind of problems. So, um, once again, um, I'm about to go get something to eat. But like I said, I wanted to show you guys something. Um, but it's not right here because um, we've been here the last time. Um, and also, I wanted to share with something with y'all. Um, see a lot of traffic, a lot of people going in. So, we'll get up the street. We're going to turn right here because this has been a while since it's been like this. Um, two weeks ago, it wasn't like this. Um, like, there's one more than one street block. So, of course, we cannot um, go through these areas right here. So, um, like I said, a lot of business popping up around this area. And, like I mentioned, um, I read in an article online that is talking about new hunts or all that, um, all this stuff. Um, they're talking about uh, building, bringing new businesses in, like bringing new companies in, like such as um, restaurants and stuff that Huntsville never had. But talking about new Huntsville, building all these apartments out of our price range, like two thousand dollars a month for rent. So. Imagine paying that much money for just a small space or a decent space, actually. But you could pay that much money in a, per month for a new house, something like that. So, to me, like, it's very too much that um, 
we're working our butts off. Inflation is very high. Gas prices are going back up. And I don't think that inflation will stop anytime soon, or is it? So you be the judge of that. So, yeah. And I wanted to show you all that traffic. And usually, there's not this much traffic late at night unless, you know, well, this guy is going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way, sir. Going the wrong way. Yeah, you better go get out the way before you get hit, man. Wow, like I said, people cannot drive. Welcome to Huntsville, folks. It was, it wasn't even like this before. Um, people tend to crash into each other, and I watched a YouTube video about it. Um, a driver that almost hit another driver, and the driver honked his horn to warn him. And guess what he did? He threatened him with a gun, cussing him out. He knocking on his window, and all, all this stuff like he, like he was the innocent one. Can you believe that? For real. So, yeah, it's just like this sometimes around here. So, um, yeah, so this reason you need to be very careful at night. You know, there's a lot of drunk drivers on the road, you know, and it, people do not seem to care when they drink, drive drunk or being careless late at night. Fridays and Saturdays are the worst. I tell you what, they are the worst. So, um, oh yeah. One thing I needed to mention is that um, I am currently writing a script for the next newscast. It's talking about dating sites online. So I'm going to be talking about lots of different dating sites, including Grinder, Tinder, POF, Plenty of Fish, OK Cupid, all this, all this other stuff. So okay, so like I said, um, all these websites, you know, the reason I want to talk about it is because recently there have been a lot of fake profiles and you know they're trying to get you they are using photos of other women and they are pretending to be hot women so really um, they're trying to trick you and trick you into sending money which I never do by the way but I wanted to warn you guys um, all that stuff so I'm gonna be talking about it in the next newscast and it's like um I'm just gonna say it's gonna be very interesting. So please be on the lookout. So yeah, I think traffic is about to clear up now. Um and people are just going home. And I think this camera is going to us. Yeah, that's better. Okay, so um yes, yeah, so I can see much more clearly now, so okay, let's keep walking. So um, really, there's a lot of restaurants popping up around here because they want to make Huntsville like Nashville and Birmingham, which, you know, a lot of traffic every time I drive home from work, you know, things get a little crazy around here. So, yeah, I mean, when it's very hot outside, you know, it's recently hot this week. It's going to be very hot again next week. And, you know, imagine summertime when your job is working outside all day, you know. Whew. It's gonna be a tough one. So, um, yeah, people coming in. You know, I know people get tired of work all week and wanted to take a break over the weekend. But fortunately, some people do still do have to work. Uh, people work seven days a week, uh, which that sucks for them. Um, you know, people coming from from the bond bond said, "Oh, I, I wanted to know what's going on over there tonight." So, yeah, I mean. The reason I want to take you over there is because, you know, there's a lot of traffic, you know, it's lining car, cars lining up, so, yeah. Alright, so, um, I think traffic's about cleared up, you know, while I was coming in this way, um, it was, it was like, a lot of cars coming out the VB site, so, um, I think we're just gonna go back that way and end this newscast from there, but, so, um, yeah, so I got a lot of exciting um, for season 11. You know, things gonna be popping. 
you know, I'm trying to amp my graphic business up. I'm not trying to get shirts made too, but the person that's supposed to make it is just, you know, not responding to me for some reason. But I'm trying to get shirts made so I can celebrate this 11 year anniversary. It's 2022. We should get our <coughs> we should get our business to where we're supposed to be, but so far we're not because people are tripping. People don't want to do business with you. And, you know, I try to do business with people, but they just do not respond. I'm a good businessman. I'm trying to, you know, get my name out there. You know, I do good business with people. So why are they tripping for real? So I guess we just wait here until this light changed one more time. So um, right there is Bring Big Spring Park right over there. I don't know what's going on over there. Um, there's a lot of barricades, you know, and this area on the left is about to be developed right there. So, um, let's go. Got two more minutes left, and I got a lot of free time of recording. So, um, I'm about to end this newscast right here. So. We're just gonna go back up that way um, and, you know, get all the people lining up for Sammy T's and stuff. I mean, I do like Sammy T, don't get me wrong. Very beautiful, it's very cool, has great music, has a lot of booming music, that is. <sighs> hey, look. Very live tonight, on a Friday night, end of the work week. Very positive note. I'm glad I ended this week on a positive note. Can't wait to do it again next week, but it's gonna be very tiring, so, because it's gonna be hot outside, and it's about to be summertime, but I'm making all the money that I can, so, you know, I can afford better things in life. You know what I mean? You know, we can't live poor forever or some point, but you gotta prepare yourself when, um, you know, when you get older and stuff, so you can pair, you know, spend money, you know, get a decent living situation, you know, you can't live on poverty forever, so. Yeah, so, um, Right now, we're going to go that way. Um, you see this little area right there, right? There used to be lighting over there. <coughs> For some reason, <coughs> getting developed. Well, I did this on the last new tab where I showed you that area last time. I think we didn't go in this alley, but we'll go there anyway. Walk back around, um, you know, and we'll end this newscast from there. So. Um, gotta be careful watching all that traffic here. Um, Porta John. Yeah, this area used to have colorful lights. You know, that Porta John smells back here. So, very dark, you know, very dark alley. Nice drawing, by the way, right there. This area still get developed. I wonder what is being developed. Could it be a dance hall? Could it be a new restaurant? Who knows? So we just go go back around, give me something to eat, you know, and then we'll end this newscast from there. So you're going back around, you know. People playing music. Yeah. Very nice area right here. You gotta be careful of this puddle right here. And this is where we at the last time, you know. people playing music as normal so
This is where I'm going to go eat at right there. They have the best food over there. I'm back now I have to tell you I tried Humphreys their wings are good but my mouth is completely burnt they're hot wings that they gave me instead of regular so my mouth is still on fire right now I had literally three glasses of water to fan the flames out so imagine your mouth being on fire while still eating the wings, trying to finish up for what you're, what you're paying for. So, literally, the wings literally burnt my mouth. Still on fire. So, I had to run water through my tongue just to calm it down some. So, yeah. So... I'm going to end this newscast from here and I literally had caught a few people great morning in this area a few months ago and it was very epic. People are cheering them on. So it's just very epic tonight, you know, people are having fun, you know, going through them all. People getting hot dogs and stuff. People going to clubs and stuff. People are, that's where most people are hanging out at, so. All right. This is what happens when you flex on the street. When you get caught by the police, this is what happens. You pay a bigger penalty, trying to show off, trying to be better than everybody else. All right, welcome back, folks. You know. Had the best food ever. Had wings, had fries. I mean, I told you, the food was so good. So, going to be the end of this newscast from there. So, um, just going to go walk up a little bit. You know, people get, going crazy, people getting drunk. So, I think, oh shit, look at that. People skating and stuff. How about that? How about that?
Look at that. Look at that. Wow. People having fun tonight. But anyways, um, I'm about to end this newscast right here and, and have fun. So, I'm about to end this newscast right here. So, until next time, I'm Jerome Martin, founder and graphic designer of Jerome Martin Studios. I'm out. Peace. Okay, so, I think this is not the end of the video yet, but I just wanted to let you guys know, um... I had advice from someone and I said I should record more but um, I just wanted to let you guys in on a little extra something uh, before I end this newscast right here. Um, see this guy right here, um, he used to make great music, he currently makes great music and he is I think on Instagram and I don't know if he has a YouTube video but um, yeah. There's a lot of great music out here. A lot of boomboxing and all that stuff. But, you know. Yeah. So, I just wanted to catch you guys up on what's been happening lately. So, um, I am ending this newscast for real. And I hope I see y'all next time. So, I'm Jerome Harden, founder and graphic designer of Jerome Harden Studios. I'm out.